alpine skiing is one of the Winter Olympics' flagship events. Skiers complete the course one by one in a race against the clock. They negotiate poles or gates positioned down the slope. A skier who misses a gate or strays off course is disqualified. The fastest competitor wins. The discipline includes two speed events, the downhill and the super G, made in single runs. Two technical events, the giant slalom and the slalom, a two-run event on different tracks. And finally, a mixed race, the super combined. The downhill slope has few turns and gates are positioned a wide distance apart. The slope is extremely steep, meaning skiers sometimes hit speeds of more than 150 km per hour. Skiing in a straight line, the competitor crouches in the aerodynamic egg position. When travelling over certain bumps, the ski is propelled into the air, crouching and arms extended forward. The Super G course is shorter than the downhill course and has more turns. The Giant Slalom is an even shorter, more technical course with more gates and more frequent, sharper turns. The shortest alpine skiing event is the slalom. The skier goes from gate to gate in less than a second. There are two types of gate to negotiate, horizontal and vertical. The competitors ski as close as possible to the gates and throw themselves through the turns using their hands and legs. Facing the gate with their knees bent, they're constantly on their edges. The super combined is a short downhill race followed by a slalom run. The five events are virtually the same for men and women. For women's events, distances and elevations are slightly reduced. Times are taken to the nearest hundredth of a second. The clock starts when the skier pushes through an electronic bar at the starting gate. Skis are made of composite materials. The length and shape vary depending on the race. Downhill skis are longer than slalom skis. The bindings lock into the boots and release the foot automatically should the skier crash. Boots are rigid and support the ankles, preventing sprains. The poles are straight for technical events, curved for speed events and designed to fit against the body to be more aerodynamic. The athlete wears a protective helmet with a chin strap and mask. For the slalom, he also wears shin guards and uses pole wrist supports to attack the gates.